Well, hey there, team. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to some more Star Dynasties. As we resume with the Gronk Square, with Gary Gronk of House Gronk. More Gronks in my sentence, please. So it's still very early days. We did this sort of guided tutorial, I suppose. Um, and, we, you know, we're, we're just working it. We're working it all out. Uh, one of the sort of big first moves that we made is that we married off my daughter... Uh, no, no, we married in. We married a dude into the family to my daughter. We pull up House Gronk. We have our max 13 members at the moment. And I, I suppose, look, there's an argument for marrying someone out, like mum or something like that, to, to get a an alliance going, perhaps. That's probably a good possibility, but there's also an insular component. Um, in that we just focus on growing our member limit, right? Which at the moment is at 13. Looks like it tops out at 16. So at the moment we're making $9 a turn, I suppose. Income last turn, $10. Uh, so we're not that far off 11. We're not that far off 11. So we're going to have to explore. I, I basically want to build wealth in my empire. Now, this is the capital of the Gronk Square. There we go. Let's have a look. Repair. Plus 10 personal production. I'm more interested in making money. Here we go. Main settlement makes money. Plus 5 to base wealth. What can we pass from all of this? Plus two wealth. Plus one wealth. Plus one wealth here as well, in disrepair. All right. Well, there we go. Plus one wealth for 60 bucks. That's not a terrible deal, to be honest. Uh, these look like they're in... Well, actually, they're not in cost order, are they? Because that's out of line there. Uh, reduce unrest. Okay, okay. So, hang on. We could manage to get... We could squeeze one wealth out for 60 bucks. Now, can we improve these other places here? Chemical processing plant. Is that the same type of building? Um, it's not orbital hydroponics, but it seems to hold the same function. Plus security as well. I'm more interested in wealth, though. Okay, I don't think we're going to get a scenario where we, we get a wealth increment for less than 60 bucks. We'll have a squeeze anyway. I, I think this, this property is lost to time, basically. Oh, here we go. Hang on. Grain silo. Plus one base wealth generated by 36 off, off you Ichi. Okay, now how much of that transfers to me? Break down your income. Tax income, 0.6 from them. Okay. Well, you know what? Look, we can afford it. It seems we can afford it. Let's do it. Pick a house member to repair grain silo at 36. Ofuchi. Ofuchi. Uh, well, look, it auto orders them, so I'll send my son. Johnny Gronk. Look at him. He looks so good. Look at all these proud, mustached men. Oh, so good. All right, Johnny. Off you go, mate. Be more effective, Johnny Gronk should travel. Yeah, absolutely. You should, you should go there, mate. Yeah. Your son has started the assignment there. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Um, meanwhile, uh, what is my gross money? Nine. It's not very much, is it? I still have action points. Now, what if we just click on... Let's just click on the general action tab, right? This gives a whole bunch of stuff we can do. Nothing tyrannical. Monitor vassals. Task a member of your house is assignment. Plus one to vassal limit. Doesn't really help us that much here. Set taxes to high. Your vassals will be unhappy. Their opinion will slowly change. 
I don't want that, and I don't want to lower the taxes either. Okay, so there's not a lot of actions that we've got available, but I believe uh, spare action points turn into dollars as well. So I'm just going to end turn. Duchess Perales Bryant gave vassalage. Oh. Okay. Primo Saar wants a marriage between Johnny Gronk. Your son will be married and will live in House Gronk. Higher in the line of succession. Look, I can't do it. I don't have the members. I'll take an honor hit. I'm sorry. I've got to refuse it. And Admiral Lori Saar. What are you? What's going on with you? It's just very difficult for me to understand. The Tapia Quadrant. Jalice, eight, seven, six. Ruling House. Faction at peace with you. Just, it can't be done. It can't be done. I don't have the space. I don't have the space. I mean, unless, Unless I marry someone else out, like my mum or whatever. Maybe, mm, ask without ex uh, anything in return. What is this? Ask for his vassalage. Um, God, maybe I do marry him off. I don't know. I don't know. I'll refuse it for the moment. Your mother is dead. Jesus Christ. Oh well. Well hang on. Your spouse wants to have another child with you. What's one way to celebrate? Well, we do have a free spot. Following members are pregnant. Following members are currently trying to have a child. Is it of age? Spouse wants to have another child with me. This is my miso, is it? Joy Gronk. I mean... Yeah? See house limit. Bugger it! I'll knock her up. Let's go. You can change event pop-ups to fit your personal preferences. Showing the same places, location, amount. Okay, I'm not... I'll just press okay. I'm not that worried because I don't understand any of this. Okay, where were we? Oh, I'm going to probably need to put someone in this seat, right? Appoint your son-in-law. Who's this? Rex Gronk. Look, it's not the best mustache, but Rex, you can, you can have the seat, mate. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, we could probably use another member, even though someone's pregos. Probably could have used that marriage proposal. Um, all right, what's going on here? Not been given assignments. Johnny Gronk's not married. You can expand your empire by pressing or championing the following claims. Uh, Master of Sheraton. Request or demand Sheraton. We'll refuse. Plan attack. Oh, okay. Gain plus 50% fleet strength at Sheraton. Can you give me an idea of our comparative fleet strength right now? What if I... Can I drag Sheratan into here? No. Okay. Um. Where is this place? Oh, there it is there. 
Okay. Okay. Um. 23 bucks. Johnny Gronk. Uh, frame someone? No, arrange marriage. Laurie Shah. Now, is that the one that offered before? No. No. He knew of Duke Gary Gronk. Oh, well, they wouldn't like that. Moral consequences. Do not lie with your own blood. Yeah, no, fair enough. Admiral Laurie Shah. Yeah, she seems all right. Let's bloody get her. Let's marry her in, mate. That's fine. Is higher would join your house, Bonza. Let's go. Ask politely. Yes. Johnny Gonk is married to. All right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Welcome to the Gronk Square. Maximum number it can currently have, right? So I could have another vassal. Now, what's going on with Sheraton? Request or demand Sheraton from the Duke. Will refuse. Plan attack. Run spy network. Chance of enemy losing surprise. Chance of discovering secrets of members. Hmm. Now let's go plan attack. I guess we'll send you because you're the best man for the job. I think that's Rex. Right? Now. What's our income level at? 14.5. Oh, well, that was more, uh... No, we need to increase the passive income. Now, we're building here, is that right? Repairing the grain silo. Right. 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 Hydro... Hydrobius. Wealth 6. So, how much money am I getting from them? Point 0.7 because what's the tax 10% okay cool so absolutely improving our own holdings is the go I would say because we will get that direct wealth presumably wealth five yeah yeah so I probably should have done that but that's okay it's all good it's all good cricket um plus one wealth for 60 bucks basically um yeah cool size of your house is generating whispers unfair consumption huh all right well, what am i supposed to bloody be uh, do with that daughter-in-law Okay, whatever. Let's go. In turn. Baron Diallo May has demanded that Archon De Forbes press an unknown person's claim to rule Hydrobius. Uh, this doesn't directly affect us. Accepted it. Hydrobius is over here somewhere, isn't it? Oh, wait. Is Hydrobius my place? <gasps> Hang on. I think it is. Can I move this shit out of the way? This is Hydrobius. What's going on here? has demanded that you press Baron Consort Cordell May's claim. If this demand is not met, Donald Forbes will declare war. Accept the demand and depose Baroness Mary Marshall, who is my per Get fucked. Refuse the claim. He will declare war. All right, let's bloody disco then. You refuse Archon Dental Forbes demand. Okay, he can get buggered as far as I'm concerned. God, he's large though. 
has declared war on the Gronk Square. Okay. I don't like that. Baron Brone Elliot has broken allegiance with the Vasquez Confederation and has pledged McBuda to the Tapia Quadrant, which is these blokes that maybe? No, these blokes. In in retaliation for Baron Brone being fined. He, he fined, so we're gonna secede. Jesus. Teeny Tapia has established a new league of factions, the Tapia Quadrant. Oh, you can do that? Oh, they're shattering. Your daughter and your son-in-law had a baby. What is this child's name? Axel? A baby girl. Yeah, whatever. That'll do. Good for you. You have allowed the population of House Gronk to get larger than is considered fair. Yeah, okay. Axel's now a member. Oh, he's very cute as well. Alright, we might be in a fucking pickle. We've just gone to war with the biggest bloody bullies in the entire sector. Okay, what are we going to do about that? Size of your house. Can't fix that. You have a significant military advantage if you were to attack Beta Hydri. You can end the war by pressing... No. No, it's not going to happen. Beta Hydri, let's go. Attack. How? 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 Attack. Yes. Commander has a significant impact on strength. Right? Our Admiral Rex Gronk also gives you access to the following tactics. If you select our Admiral Commander in this combat, each of their tactics will be available twice. Okay, whatever. Yeah, I guess let's send Rex. Rex seems like a pretty good bloke. I'm glad we married him in. Happiness thrilled. He fucking loves me. Let's go. Send in Rex. Now has this trait. What's his trait? Assigned to fleet. Okay. Good work. Good work, Rex. Good work, Rex. Okay. Add your house's military fleet. Absolutely. Join. Ah... Uh, Call. 40% of getting busted. Wait, ask? Oh, no, that, that may accept if you ask politely. Really? You hate Beta Hydri that much? That's a bloody thing? Okay. Hang on, we could use more yellow. Look at that. Oh, yeah, we got to do this. Will accept. <sighs> Good. Good. Ask. May accept. Will accept. I mean, that's interesting that... Wow, they must have some bad blood, man. Um, I'm going to call for them. Has become aware of the attack. All right, now they're bloody rallying up. He gets his four turns. His forces join the fleet. Oh, maybe he doesn't get four full turns. Oh, whatever. Higher mercenaries? Nah, looks like we're going to pound this dude. Let's go. Launch. Oh, no. Then he gets his four goes. Oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, no. This is doable. This is doable. Pick, pick tactic as attacker. Deal no damage. Retreat at end of round. No. Plus 5 to damage dealt, plus 20% recovery rate at end of combat. Counter. Blitz. Plus damage dealt. Plus damage taken by. Uh, now, how does the rock, paper, scissors work? I'm, I'm assuming blue beats red, red bleats yellow. You know, like, I'm assuming it's circular. Tactical Abandoned Policy Blitz. Oh, we get two of them. All right, I think I might use the Blitz because let's just assume blue beats red and that's even Steven. Minus four, damage taken. 
attacker's effectiveness roll. Oh, look at that! What a fisting! Yes! Oh, yeah. No, they fisted back, but that's okay. Pick tactic as attacker. Put put the put the foot on the neck. Ooh, that's not a good roll. Ooh. Um, attack. Tactical abandon policy. Plus recovery rate at the end. Plus five percent damage dealt. That just seems like good news across the uh, uh the, the board, right? Yeah, I like that. Defender wins? What are you fucking talking about? I've still got an army. What's this bullshit? The Forbes territories have defeated the Gronk Square. Do we only get three goes? Your forces have suffered a defeat. Your son-in-law salvaged what he could from the wreckage. From combat tactics used. Oh, okay. You failed to conquer them. Well, that's bullshit. You told me I could beat him. Sargas. What's going on here? Fuck. Can I, like, suck you in to request allegiance? May accept if you ask politely. Moral consequences. Well, we're at war with them. We're at war with them. Give me that. Will you request or make a demand? I, w I will not make this request. I'll ask politely. Oh, 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 let's go. Has broken allegiance with Forbes territories and has pled Sargas to the gro in retaliation for being fined. So she's all good. Now, that, that shouldn't have hurt my... Oh, hang on, hang on. War declared. Demand a press claim. Admiral Sign Gronk died. Oh, that's my happiness. Hang on. Honor. Allowed them to get... My honor's intact. My honor's intact. Yes. Because because we're at war, I can do dishonorable things against my opponent. Yes. Get fisted. Yes. Yes. Members 14 out of 13. I don't know what to do about that. Like, can I just bloody systemically kill my people? I'd rather not kill my family, okay? Um, yeah, I'd rather not. What can I do with you? Request Beta Hydri from Archon Donald Forbes. Why would he maybe take it? Did he not declare war on me? He declared, yeah, no, he pressed a claim and then declared war. Request Beta Hydra. Yeah, shit. If he might, yeah, give me that. Give me it. He refused to give you it. Thinks this would not be in his interests. Safety, wealth, whatever. Fuck off. Okay. Yeah, I thought I'd ask anyway. YOLO, right? Um, okay. Okay. My happiness isn't super high. You failed to conquer. Yeah, okay. Request. Plan attack. Demand Gronk Square's claim to be the master of there. Run spy network. Acquire claim. Well, how's this go? If this demand is accepted, the war with the territory will end. 
demanded Archon Donald Forbes honor the Gronk Square's claim to be the master of the Forbes territory and become his vassal. What? That's all a bit strange, isn't it? Oh, I'm very confused. Um, repairing installations at home. Yes. Plus 10 personal protection. I don't know what that means. Uh, let's save up our dollars. What is this? My vassals. Right, yeah, because I've got a new vassal. Okay. What can we do here? Hide fleet movements. Improve defenses. Rebuild fleet. Plus fleet replenishment rate. Well, how do I know it needs replenishing? Like, if I go... No... Uh, uh, no, 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 cancel, cancel this, never mind. Tell, show me Sargas's fleet. Power projection? What is, what is this nonsense? Oh, yeah, hang on. Fleet strength. Wait, you're the shielder in charge, right? Distant relative. What is this? Fleet strength? 5 out of 13. Uh, okay. Action. Shift fleet composition. Gradually shifts the composition of fleet, maintain its service to emphasize a specific vessel type. Okay. Task member of your house is. Yeah, okay. Plus replenishment rate. The exact effect will be identified when you select the house member. Hide def improved defenses. All right. Let's um. I don't know. Rebuild fleet. Oh no no no! He's already repairing. We'll send this bloke, Jory. That'll do. Okay, that's fine. Okay, cool. Intern. Your wife is in love with you. Oh well, that's lovely. The armory at Gamma Andromeda has been repaired. All right, now we're bloody talking. Grain silo's been repaired, let's go. Plus one base wealth to them. Your son has returned home. Good, good, good. He's a good, he's a good lad. Your wife has discovered a hidden room deep in the bowels of the colony. What? What are you doing down there, Shaz? We were lucky to find it. Whoever built it didn't want it to be discovered. We think it was a surveillance post there's a listening device, transmitter, and bank of cryptographic algorithms. Oh, hang on. We've got... Oh, makes our spy networks more effective. Uh -huh. You find a cache of spy novels in the hidden surveillance room. Evidently, whichever spy was stationed here enjoyed both real and fiction espionage. Or oh, I had too much time on their hands. You crack one open. Trust nobody, he said. The person closest to you is the one best place to stab you in the back. I suppose that would be Johnny Gronk, but surely he wouldn't. No, I refuse to suspect those in close to me. Yeah. Johnny Gronk. No, I love Johnny. He would never betray me. We're running out of medical equipment. At this point, we can barely provide basic medical care to the serfs and servants pledged to House Gronk. We have held a small stock in reserve for ourselves, but that will dwindle eventually. We need to find a longer term solution. We have to make do with what we have. Probability a house member gets ill. Look, we've got the money. We've got the money. Let's do it. Our medical support is worse than we thought. By holding in reserve some medical equipment for ourselves, we've underestimated the scale of the problem. The rank and file of House Gronk have been left to fend for themselves against the ravages of space sickness, poor nutrition, and anaerobic fleas. Dr. Blaine Gronk will handle this. Yeah, she's on it. Your sister did her best. We've repaired some of the medical equipment that might otherwise have been discarded. Our reserves remain low, but they should still hold for a while. There's only so much your sister could do with limited resources. That's cool. Your son has been acting strangely. He goes out at odd hours to unmap sections of the station. Could he be hiding something? What are you doing, Johnny? He can do what he likes. I hope he doesn't sense my misgivings. No, we're good. Johnny loves me. And I love him. 
Our listening post has picked up several messages from ships throughout Cadjum. Here we go. Interesting. These names are new to you. Oh, who are all these people? Okay. You found out that Master Kel Bryant is attracted to Duchess Perales Bryant. Well, well, well. What is your relationship? I can't, I can't see that. Okay. Um, how do I? Yeah, don't, don't I compare that or something? Oh. Huh. Well, hang on. Let's have a look at your family tree. Wait, that's his mum. No, this can't be right. Kel Bryant is attracted to Duchess Perales Bryant. No. Kel Bryant's son. Ew! What can I do with that? Ew! What can I do with that? Reveal. Potentially embarrass him. Defame. Spread lies. Oh, I don't know. Oh, what, what to do with that? Okay, cool. Well, the I guess he is in the other faction. Oh, maybe I will. Oh, okay. Well, you know, intrigue, I suppose. This is cool. I'm enjoying this. Uh, I'm moving very slowly. I do know with, like, my experience with Crusader Kings is once you get in the rhythm of it and you know what you're doing, you can actually fly through it. Because, uh, like, well, there's, there's like a million different things that can be going on, but there'll only really be one or two things actually going on. So figuring out how to deal with every different thing takes a long time to build that knowledge. But then, as you do, you find that the gameplay can move a lot faster. But it's still slow going in the early days. Alright team, thanks again for joining me. I might just leave it there for the time being and I'll catch you guys on the next one.